Hey guys and welcome back to my channel, welcome back to a brand new brand video. We've got a try on haul today from none other than Because of Alice. So I hope you guys are all doing well. I just wanted to jump on today because I placed a big order on the Because of Alice sale that's happening. They have had it on, I think it's been on for a few, couple of weeks now, but it's an indefinite sale at the moment. So by the time you guys are seeing this video, it might still be live. Um, I just ended up picking up loads of stuff. It's one of my favorite little online boutiques. It's one I'd never heard of before, but I am so passionate about now. I love their designs. I love the quality and I genuinely just really love the brand. And this is a completely non-sponsored video. I wish, trust me because of Alice, if you want to work with me, just, just give me a shout. But I've just got a real passion for these guys. I placed this humongous order and I got some incredible what I think will be capsule pieces. So I really wanted to share them with you guys today to give you some inspiration if Because of Alice might be a brand for you. So without further ado, grab your favourite drink, sit down, cosy up and enjoy this bonus Jonas Sunday upload because we have got some awesome bits in here. So if you haven't heard of Because of Alice before, I think I came across them on Instagram. They are a fairly smaller brand. They're kind of like a boutique. They definitely are in there with like Zara, Stradivarius. That's the kind of vibes they give me. But they are like extremely like good quality. I feel like if you buy an item from Because of Alice, it's kind of gonna like last you a really long time. It's one of those, it's capsule pieces basically. And what I'm really sold on is I love their suits. I have been so tempted to buy a full suit for so long, but they are quite expensive. So when I seen the sale come around, I was like, right, I'm gonna definitely order some and try them at least. So they all come individually wrapped and packaged like this. I will get them all out of the packaging before I show you guys, obviously, because I can't be doing with all this rattling. So we're getting straight into it. I literally don't know where to start. I did place quite a big order Obviously some of this I think will be going back because um, I kind of just wanted to order a bit of everything just to see how it is There's like a certain dress in here that I think might not fit me perfectly It's very form-fitting and I don't know if it will work. So I kind of just wanted to try it all so we're gonna try it on today. The first suit I ordered was actually perfect for autumn. It is this perfectly gorgeous chocolate brown suit. Now I ordered the trousers, these one here, in a large and an extra large to try them. And I can report that they are true to size. So I am gonna stick with the large, which I think they say is a 12 to 14. Um, the website does have all the guides. So this is what they look like. Now what I will say is because of Alice is definitely a brand with their trousers that runs the, the trousers are so long like even on the tallest people I think these will still be far too long so the suit that I do keep I'm gonna get tailored and make sure that I get the um, get it hemmed at the bottom because they are extremely long when I do the try on clip in a moment you're gonna see me wearing them with court heels because that's how I would wear a suit hundred percent I love the seaming down the middle it's super flattering and these fit like a glove they are just absolutely perfect and then to go with the trousers this is the suit top now I really love this the suit blazer sorry so all of the suits come with this belt as well so the idea is is that it's supposed to be modeled like this this is the suit on the model that I bought um this also needs a good iron if I do keep it so make sure you just ignore the creases but we've got a couple of really nice pockets at the front they are not real though unfortunately there is shoulder pads and it is super super heavy so here is the brown suit this is so flattering how autumnal is this this is complete autumn winter 2022 vibes i am loving loving the look of this um i have done the belt up again the exact same way i do need to kind of read up how to do it properly because there is um a way to specifically do it obviously you can kind of do it however you want you could even you know do a bow if that's what you're into i wouldn't you know you're supposed to just play around with it and see how you like it personally i definitely just like the whole slouchy chucked over and then if we undo this we've just got the nice natural chill look i definitely feel like the brown is more corporate so i definitely feel this is more like it could it's it's, it's easier to look very more dressed up whereas the um dusty rose the other color i got i do feel like that is a bit more casual it's definitely something that's easier to lighten up but yeah this is what it looks like i also just kind of love the trousers on their own i really like 
but because of Alice trousers, I feel like they're super flattering. Like I said, I got these in an L and they honestly fit me perfectly. I definitely think they're 100% true to size. I am half tempted just to keep these trousers because I think I'll wear them a lot in autumn. I then picked up the same suit in this absolutely beautiful dusty pink color i think that's what they call it they call it dusty rose um i got the trousers in oh this is xl so i picked them up in an xl and an l again but it turns out that l is the right size so that's all good i was a bit worried that they were going to be a bit um they were going to be a bit like undersized because like just like all the models are so small and obviously because it's giving me zara vibes and stuff i was like probably is gonna run small, but thankfully I can say they're true to size. This is the blazer top of the Dusty Rose. The Dusty Rose was the first one I was drawn to. As you can see, I really like this, this sort of muted pink color. I think it's lovely. I love neutral. So heavy, these jackets. Um, but this is the classic blazer with belt, like I showed you earlier in the brown. And I got the top in a size L as well, because again, on the model, it's meant to be very like kind of oversized but because the belt pulls it in that's what kind of looks nice so I think that these are the perfect size for me I don't think I would have liked to have gone for the XL so that's all good along with the dusty rose suit this was in the I think 80% off section and I thought I'm just gonna grab that because it matches basically identically to the dusty rose suit this is just a very simple bodysuit it is just a bandeau top it's got the rubber lining along here which i so appreciate because it just holds you up especially when you wouldn't wear this with a bra it is like it feels like literally double or triple lined it feels so so thick it's that sort of swimsuit stretchy material but i bought this to go with the suit so that is what i'm going to try it on with and see if it works together this was on sale i think for six pounds it was really really cheap so I thought I'll just grab it I can definitely just wear this with a pair of shorts anyway um, but quality again even for a bodysuit is really really good so here is the dusty rose suit I absolutely feel the best version of myself in this honestly it is just feels like it's tailored to me apart from the bottoms as you can see I've tried to get it all in frame they are just far too long they are so so long but that's kind of known for every single review I've seen of because of Alice said that the trousers are way too long. Um, but obviously I suppose that's good if you're a tall girl, I'm just average height. I absolutely love the belt, so I'm going to come in a little further. So I've put the belt round. There is actually a tutorial apparently on how to properly do the belt. Um, but this is what it looks like as it's meant to look. But literally I've just put it on backwards and then round and tied it up obviously you don't need this so you can just have it with the button done up or alternatively actually my favorite way of wearing it is just open like this i think this looks really really nice i just feel like this is super casual like it's a sunny day today you know we could go out for some brunch and chuck on the sunglasses like i feel really like i'm just about to become the ceo of my own dream company that i have manifested for years this is that suit and also then what's really great is i love the look of how the um trousers and just the bodysuit looks so this is such a cute just outfit on its own how absolutely flattering as well as this i feel so so I just feel like the best version I really do of myself. I am 100% keeping all of this. Oh, I've just noticed. Oh my gosh, that's annoying. Look at this. Can you see there? Oh dear. I'm going to have to get this changed. But either way, I absolutely love this. I then picked up one dress. Now, this looks very different. The colour of this looks extremely different in person than it does on the model. So this is what it looks like here. It is in the colour olive to be fair and I would say this is an olive but this is the exact same material as the bodysuit. Now I am 99.9% .9 sure I am going to not like this on whatsoever simply because one it looks like it's running a little bit small i did pick this up in an l it is the bando midi dress they did this in black and white as well but as you can see it's super slim line um and i have a very hourglass body and certainly i feel this is going to pick up every lump and bump now it might not because it's that lovely double lined scuba style material um but i have a sneaky suspicion it will but either way the first impressions is it's beautiful it has got a zip down the side so it's not fully expected to be like 
you know, you have to step into it. It is meant to be a more fitted formal dress. It goes all the way down, so it's gonna be like a mid-axi. And at the back, this is my favorite detail, it's got a split. So comfy, so casual. Again, bandeau, and it's got that rubber, so you're gonna keep it, it's gonna stay up. But it's just super simple, very simple, and I kind of want to love this, but I just have a feeling it's gonna be far too slimline and a little bit grabby, but we'll have to see. So here is the olive dress. It definitely looks way better than I thought it would. I have put on some spanks with it just because I was thinking, you know, it probably is gonna be super, super grabby. It definitely is grabby, but I think because it is that two layer and it's almost like spank material actually, I think it's actually okay, you know? I do really like this. I think it's nice and I'm really warming to this color. I thought it was gonna be a bit dark because on the picture to me, it kind of looked a bit more lighter but actually i am loving it i love the split at the back i mean it does feel like it is literally holding you in like i said they did this in black as well so if you're thinking maybe you like the style of this but you're not too confident with the color they did white white would be not forgiving i don't think whatsoever but i'd be very confident that the white wouldn't be see-through just based on the material that i'm feeling now but the split at the back is so lovely the top again they had the it has the um elastic around here i did kind of notice that now and again it kept flopping down but now i can't like that there you go when i try and pull it up it kind of just flops down a little bit like that so sometimes you'll just have to readjust it but when you get it to the right thing like that it does seem to stay so it does seem okay i'm not wearing with the bra with this whatsoever as well and i think it's super flawless because it is double lined you don't even get like any shape at all it just looks really nice and i even think especially being a curvier girl this is actually really complementing the curves like i don't know i'm just feeling super confident in this dress yeah i am loving the color and i'm loving the feel I'm pretty sure this was like reduced to 20 pounds so yeah definitely thumbs up and then finally i picked up a couple of basics which i thought would be good just to have in the wardrobe so these are the slouchy shoulder padded tee now i picked these up in a large they have got the shoulder pads in them they're not too intrusive though they don't feel too much i'm slightly worried though about putting these in the wash i've had t-shirts with shoulder pads before and the minute you wash them literally the shoulder pads just get all creased and you can't straighten them out and it kind of ruins the t-shirt um so i'm hoping that won't do this but it's just a absolute basic i really liked this i thought i'd grab it as they were in the sale so this is the black one here and this is the white one here i thought they'd both be capsule pieces that are just super easy to use i might have probably have got medium i don't know again i'll have to try and see when i when i do the trial clip but um yeah like the pads to be fair they actually look like they're they're sewn in they're not going anywhere to be fair so here is the black shoulder tee um definitely feel i should have got this in a medium i just feel so so square right now so square i don't know i'm wearing it with black shorts right now so i know it's probably a bit hard to see but it comes down to here it's definitely quite long um but yeah this is the black tee and this is the white one i definitely feel like yeah this is just not sitting quite right on me i feel like it's just way too boxy it's doing nothing for me it's kind of just pulling it all out and just making me feel very square but very comfortable very thick cotton but just yeah it's a shame i don't i think i should have got these in a medium so guys, that's gonna go ahead and conclude my little because of Alice haul. I say little, this honestly is a lot of money's worth of clothes. The website, I'm not gonna beat around the bush. It's not a cheap site, but it's not the most expensive. Like, don't get me wrong, it's not designer prices. Um, so it's just very kind of high street kind of there. But I love how it is fairly limited, so you're not overwhelmed with loads of stuff. They come out with the collections, I think, in summer and winter, so they just drop a few items throughout the year. Um, I just love how simple it is really so thank you guys so much for watching today's video remember to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell to not miss any of my uploads as well as obviously go follow me over on instagram i am now amy michelle underscore a also if you want to follow any of the home or any of my interior content i have got amy michelle home now over on instagram i would really appreciate a follow there oh and i'm forgetting i just got tiktok too amy michelle a amy michelle underscore a again on tiktok I'd really appreciate it guys because I have not been on a new platform on social media for so long. I've been trying not to get TikTok and then I was like, do you know what? 
why am I fighting it? Why am I fighting it? Everything's about TikTok now. But thank you guys for spending some time with me today. Remember to stay safe and stay beautiful, and I will see you all on Wednesday for another upload. Ciao.